the court of Versailles is best known for its wealthy aristocracy, gilded rooms, and well-kept gardens. In reality, the French court was dirtier and filthier than most people believe. Although Versailles was beautiful on the outside, living there was a different story. Easified. There was human waste everywhere. Due to a lack of plumbing, chamber pots were thrown out of windows. People passing by would have to exercise caution. Flying waste is said to have hit even Marie Antoinette. It wasn't unusual to see someone relieve himself or herself. Many courtiers went to the toilet whenever and wherever it was convenient. Bathrooms were a nightmare. Despite the fact that residents had commodes and chamber pots in their private chambers, Versailles had public latrines. However, given the estate's large population, this was a woefully inadequate supply. They frequently overflowed, allowing sewage to leak into neighboring rooms through the walls and flooring. The excessive use of perfumes. The foul odors in the park, gardens, and even the chateau raise one's gorge. To combat unpleasant odors and purify the surrounding air, the courtiers used vast quantities of perfume. However, the popularity of fragrances exacerbated the problem by adding yet another scent to the already offensive odor. Wigs infested with lice. Louis XIV is said to have helped popularize wigs in France in order to conceal the fact that he was losing his hair. Another advantage of wearing wigs was that lice were more likely to infest the wigs rather than the wearer's scalp. It was far easier to eliminate an infestation by boiling a lice-infested wig rather than manually picking the lice out of hair. Hot water was thought to be harmful. Many people believed that taking a hot bath was unhealthy. Warm water was thought to weaken the body and open pores, making it easier for infections to enter. People found that having a fast wash to be far safer and healthier than soaking in a tub, and not just in France. Historians believe the Sun King only had two baths over the course of his entire life. However, he always cleaned his hands in the morning, dried himself off with a towel, and cleansed his body with alcohol and perfume. <laughs>